As part of Pike County's 4-H Fair, students from Eastridge High School displayed projects spanning over 20 different subjects to build skills for later development. Tuesday, Mountaintop spoke with County Extension Agent Novella Froman about the fair. These projects are done at home so that parents are, and grandparents are sharing their skills. So there are different types like photography can be useful like for when you were uh, of the, that age, if you had had those kind of skills and the project and the training, it would have helped you in your career. So it, it's different levels uh, that teaches them. For example, woodworking. We have some wonderful woodworking projects and the children learn how to put wood together and that's our future carpenter. So that's some of the ways that we prepare for the future. We are Pikeville Medical Center. And we are an amazing place to work. Healthcare heroes of all types work here. All who deserve great rewards. So while our heroes are working hard to take care of our patients and visitors, we are taking care of them with top-tier benefits, higher pay rates, and great sign-on bonuses. So join our team today. So what are you waiting for? Apply today. Incredible opportunities await at pmcjobs.org. During the fair, students came together for music and activities to celebrate their completed projects. Students Emily Conley and Alyssa Thompson describe how the projects work. There's different categories you can go into. Some of them teach them about leadership. Some of them teach them, you know, just basic life skills. If you've done a certain project, you're more likely to know more about that. And so, like, say you do a project on animals. If you go into, like, vets and stuff, like, you'll be like, oh, I've done a 4 H thing on it. And while students were excited to display their projects, Froman says she hopes the experience will create memories. I remember I had a public speaker that told me one time, he said, you know, the first time I went to a 4-H fair, I was so nervous uh, because we think that, take it for granted, but so nervous, but I couldn't believe that somebody really liked my art project and I got a blue ribbon. So that, that's what they're talking about, the memories. and. People tell me they have like a footstool they made for years that they made in 4-H. And I, yeah, and I think in 4-H we make the best better. For Mountaintop News, I'm Joel Cordial.